Welcome to the Art Project, Inktober 2019, day number seven, Enchanted. Enchanted was kind of a difficult one for a lot of my students. Uh, not all of them, some of them pulled off some really amazing things, with some really amazing ideas you'll see at the end of the video. I uh, peruse some of my student work, but... Uh, but it was kind of hard to think of, like, what is enchanted? Uh, one of the things that came to a lot of minds was Beauty and the Beast or the movie Enchanted. Well, if you look it up, it's basically something that has a magical effect or a magical spell uh, cast on it, or seems to. Um, so... In typical uh, animator fashion, I think, uh, the only way to really show that is to create some sort of aura around it. Uh, maybe not the only way to do that, but the, the way that a lot of illustrators do it is by creating some sort of aura. Uh, also of note is the challenge of Inktober here is, especially for me, is that I'm using this skull over and over and over again. And so one of the challenges is that even though I'm doing the same skull over and over and over again, I'm forced to come up with new ways to use it. And so the um, full frontal view of it is worn out. <laughs> the side view of it is kind of worn out. And so for this particular one, I decided to do, I wanted to do a frontal view, but I didn't want it to be the same as the one right before it, which was Husky. And so I have kind of propped it up on a little cup and turned it uh, facing upward so that as I look at it I'm looking um, up towards the chin uh, so it's almost like the skull is floating up above me uh, which I think is to help uh, add the add to the idea of enchantment that it's up above me and floating so uh, also I would like for you to notice on the sh um, sketching it out a lot of students do that fuzzy line like like chee, 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 chee. you know just one little one little dash at a time all the way around whatever it is they're drawing that is not sketching if you have that habit please break that habit um, sketching is drawing a line where you think it should be and then redrawing the same similar line but differently to find the the right one okay so if I've got a line that's you know five inches around the skull or the um, contour or something I draw that line first and if it's not right I draw another one like real quickly right after it and I real quickly judge the two lines that's sketching not that ch -ch 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 -ch, that makes everything look fuzzy um, anyway, that's just a little side note. Uh, also, uh, to talk about here is the technique that I'm using for this particular one is a little bit closer to the Scott M. Fisher technique that I've been watching on YouTube lately. Uh, Scott M. Fisher is an illustrator for uh, things like Magic the Gathering and um, other books and uh, comic books and comic book covers and uh, you should check him out. He's got a lot of really cool stuff. Uh, but one of the things I've noticed him doing is laying down a lot of color in a particular area and then going back and using uh, another color with a pen like this to hatch or cross hatch shade over it. Really, really neat effect. Uh, I think I've just kind of fallen in love with it. You can expect to see more of that for me uh, later. Um, so I did the drawing first, I painted over it with the gold uh, ink, and then I could still see my lines that I drew underneath and through the gold. So I just started, I kept looking at the skull, you can see the skull on the top of the screen there, and I just kept looking at it and finding the shadows and shading them in by hatching with a black pen. Uh, then I decided to go around it with some enchanting looking... Uh, smoke or flames I'm not sure it's not really flames but kind of flame shaped anyway that's uh, that this is my student work a lot of really cool ones there and um, 
they did a really good job of that. And so, um, anyway, hope you enjoyed Enchantment. Can't wait to see what y'all have done. Can't wait to check yours out. Tag me on Instagram in your photo so I can see your Instagram for Enchantment. Go make some art. <laughs>